Not too long ago on one of my videos entitled how to add fretboard diagrams to your score in MuseScore 4, one of our um, viewers left a very good question which was can the diagrams that you create be saved to some type of master library so that they can be reused in other songs? And um, I've often wondered the same thing myself but I had to admit at the time that I didn't think that this was possible until very recently um, when someone else very kindly left the solution to that problem um, right on the same video. So I'm going to walk us through the steps um, to do that in this video. So as we can see, I've already created the, the uh, fretboard diagrams that I want to save, and I'm going to save these to the fretboard diagrams palette in the left sidebar here. So let's walk through the steps. If you're on a Windows keyboard, you want to hold down the Windows and Shift keys together. On a Mac keyboard, the Command and Shift keys, and on any other kind of keyboard, the Control and Shift keys. And when you do that, and then you click on one of these diagrams, we can see that a plus icon appears ab above the diagram, and we can then simply just drag and drop it into the uh, fretboard diagrams palette like so. And then we have um, our newly created fretboard diagrams saved and ready to use for the next application. So it really is as easy as that. Hope you found this video helpful. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one.